Have you ever tried using wireless debugging? There are many reasons you want to do it. For example, you have a big computer and can't install an emulator. And of course, using USB is really painful for debugging. Or you do have an emulator, but it can't accomplish complex operations like Google Sign-in. So in this video, let's learn how can we debug without USB using Wi-Fi. Open Microsoft Edge and write STK platform tools. Open the first website and scroll down. Here you can see the download STK platform for Windows. Click it, there you can ignore all the terms and conditions. Just scroll down, accept everything and click here to download. It will be downloaded in a few seconds and once it's done, you can find it in downloads folder. Just go ahead and extract the zip folder. The next step is to add it inside your environment variables and for doing it, copy the extracted folder's location. Open environment variables and find a path. Click edit and create a new path and paste it here. Then hit OK to everything and close it off. Then connect your smartphone with your PC using USB. Remember, you will need to use USB only this time and once you are done, you will have nothing more to do with it. Also, keep in mind this is my real device and not emulator. And here I am showing it to you using a software. So far we have gone most of the way and if you found it useful, please make sure to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to get more videos from us. Let's continue with the video. Now if I open terminal and run ADP devices, I can see my phone being connected, which means we were successful. So without wasting time, connect both your PC and smartphone to the same network, which can be just a second phone. Also, make sure to enable wireless debugging. Here you can also see the IP address and port of your devices, so keep it in mind because you are gonna need it. When everything is done, go ahead and open VS Code. The first thing you do here is to install an extension called ADB interface for VS Code. As you see, I have already installed it which allows us to run ADB commands. Press Ctrl, Shift and P and run the command connect to device IP. Insert IP of your phone and hit enter. Then enter the port and now it's connected. Congratulations, you see notifications as well that wireless debugging is connected. So remove USB and run your project. 